eventually it was just us two standing down here on the other end, so we had to eventually give in, which we did, and we lost the game because of that. So in the Bahamas, you are, your play excited a lot of people. I mean, how did you benefit from, from that experience? Um, you know, I just it really I really didn't benefit from it. I just you know come out here and play, and still you know try to do my best, do what I have to do for the team, and just, you know play harder than. Are you a better free throw shooter than you showed you? Yes, I am. <laughs> um, looking at the line of great point guards that Cal's had, where do you see yourself kind of fitting and trying to join that group? Can you repeat that? The line of great point guards, you know, John Wall and Marcus Teague, and you look at guys like that and you come in and play with Cal, what are your thoughts on trying to break into that group? Um, you know, I just try not to look at that. I'm not trying to break into that group. I'm just trying to do what's best for our team. You know, they were great players then, but they're also – completely different type of players than I am because I'm a small guard, they're all big guards, so you know, I'm just going to try to play my game and do what Kyle wants me to do. Not self-excluded, how many times have you been told that you look like? A couple million. A couple million? <laughs> yeah. What do you, uh, so uh, what do you compare yourself to? Um, well, you know, I like to watch like guards like Chris Paul, Stanley Tony Parker, Steve Nash, and those guys. You know, just because how they get the, their teammates involved in the game. You know, they're all past first point guards, and you know, those are great people to watch. How much have you been at this and not how much of a big picture? Um, I feel like, you know, with the fan standpoint, it benefited me, you know. Uh, they could see me, they saw me play for once, and they don't think I'm too small now, but you know, other than that, not much. You know, I just have to come out here every day and still work hard like everybody else, and we just can't wait for the season to start. So when the lights go on, college rounds, when you're going against other teams, that this jersey on, trying to cut you out, uh, you see the difference between what's going on down there and what it is today? Have you been told to make it? Uh, yeah, I feel like there's going to be a difference in uh, the style of play. You know, those guys were a lot older than us. The you know, um, guys that are playing college are, you know, the same quickness as us, same age as us. So, you know, I just can't wait to get there. I see what it's like every day in practice with the guys I'm playing against. So, you know, everybody's getting me prepared. Tyler, when people ask you if you're too small or told you you're too small, how much motivation, how long are you motivated off of that? Um, all my life I've been motivated off of that because you know, I was a highly recruit, recruit at an early age, so you know, I just try to get in the gym, work hard, and just for everybody to run. He's done a whole bunch of athletic things throughout our very few practices that we've had. And we're the wall, specifically, like, when it's not practical, like, where'd that come out of? Because, like,